Hi, today I'll show you how to use the automated schedule weekly template. So let's first go into the category list input and we'll just create a new category. Let's call it test category. Perfect. We can then go into the first section add slash delete event and create a new event. So we can call it test event. The event detail is optional. But we'll just add in anyways. We'll assign it to our newly created test category. And for the date, let's put 1st of June 2020. That's perfect. And for the time, let's set it at 9 o'clock until 10 o'clock. Perfect. And we just need to hit Add to Calendar. And a little pop-up window will come up saying that the event has been added successfully. Now, let's say we want to delete this newly created event. Just go into search and delete. Enter the name of the event or part of the name of the event. And the list of events with these letters will come up here. Just need to select the event, hit delete event. A window will come up asking you if you're sure. Just hit yes, and that's it. Now, just for example, we'll add test event to keep everything the same and just add it to the calendar. Perfect. You can go now into the weekly calendar. So if we remember correctly, it was on the 1st of June. So we'll just go into next week. Alternatively, we can just select the week from here. So it was week 23. 1st of June. Here we go. Our test event appears right here. We can also visualize it in the dashboard directly. So we just need to select the month of June. And we can see that we've got one hour assigned to the newly created category called test category. That's it. Enjoy.